Introduction The issue of education standard between America and Europe has drawn attention of many scholars and educators. According to Sean Scarpiello, the American education system portrays a negative result when compared to education systems of other countries across the world. However, the United States education system remains the best in relation to education systems across Europe and around the world. This research looks at some similarities and differences between the European and American education systems. The aim of education In the United States, education acts a tool for the public good. Therefore, both federal and state involvement in terms of funding is paramount. On the other hand, European higher education policy aims to promote social, political, and economic issues. At the same time, the education system addresses various industrial and market challenges. The governments provide minimal funding for students pursuing higher education. A focus on the United Kingdom education system shows that the country offers practical elements of education. On the other hand, the United States promotes liberal arts education. The United States education system introduces students to broad aspects of the curriculum. Conversely, the United Kingdom education system is ideal for learners who have chosen their career paths. This approach enables learners to concentrate on their areas of specialization throughout their study period. Learners can also conduct research in areas of their interests. However, the United Kingdom education system favors lectures, seminars, and tutorials. As such, learning is not interactive. However, learners must be proactive on their own. Choices of degrees are also diverse based on individuals' interest. Test scores The United States education system has retained its superior quality for decades. In 1989, White and Ahrens compared two aspects of education systems, mass education and general education, between the United States and Europe. They established that the United States education system was superior to European education system. The United States has maintained that standard to date against Europe. However, the major concern has been the deteriorating quality of education in the United States. According to a study conducted by American Institutes of Research, students in other countries tend to do better in sciences and mathematics than students in the United States. The study presented mixed results across various European nations. Experts asserted that test results faced various challenges. As a result, such results did not provide an adequate basis for comparison of states or countries. This is because of different variations, such as different ages of learners in different grades. Therefore, such variations do not allow tests to act as tools for generalization and effective conclusions across various states or nations. Results from these studies show great disparities in the United States education system. According to Kirsch and fellow researchers, the performance gap in the United States between highest and low achiever is among the highest in Organization for Economic Cooperation and Development countries. Best Institutions Based on the World University Rankings Report of 2010-2011, the United States has the most and world's best institutions of higher learning. These institutions have produced the best professionals in various fields. It is also important to note that the best researchers work in these institutions. Educators in the United States universities are able to provide quality education to students than in other universities across Europe. The ranking shows that the best universities are in the United States and Europe. Cost Education in Europe is cost-effective compared to costs of education in the United States. However, the low cost of education has led to large classes in Europe. As a result, instructors remain disconnected to their students. Cost is a key factor that influences the quality of education. It is important for education to be free or affordable for the majority. 
However, such education systems lead to mass learning, which results into mass production of graduates. As a result, the quality of education among such graduates may be low. In the United States, the best institutions restrict the number of years a student can take in schools. Therefore, learners complete faster in the United States than in Europe. The United States also has students' loan policy. The loan is repayable after one finds employment. Student-teacher relationship Scarpiello observes that instructors in European universities do not have close interaction with their students. The most common mode of teaching involves provisions of handouts, lectures, and examinations. He notes that lecturers do not provide adequate guidance to their students in Europe. On the other hand, in the United States, student-teacher interaction is common even in large institutions of higher learning. Instructors have interaction time during classes, discussion sessions, and office hours. This enhances learning in the United States and reduces cases of rot learning. Therefore, the United States education system promotes practical learning beyond memorizing course contents. European learning institutions also tend to lack clubs and social interaction venues. Universities are also in different locations across cities. There is no single main campus. Conversely, the United States has adopted education system that promotes learning from different sources rather than lectures alone. Besides, it has learning programs to ensure that all children learn at the same pace. Thus, emphasis on social interaction is a fundamental part of the United States education system. Collaboration between the United States and Europe in education The United States has the best universities and research centers in the world. Consequently, the United Kingdom and the United States governments concur as follows science and higher education are the foundation stones of their two nations' 21st century economies and that the United Kingdom and the United States have a responsibility to further their global leadership roles in these essential fields. The United States is also the largest spend in areas of scientific research while the United Kingdom leads the G8 countries in scientific publications. Conclusion America provides the best education system in the world. It offers higher education that caters for its diversity unlike in Europe where specialization of education influences learners' choices. Though the United States education system has experienced challenges in the recent past, it remains the best system. This is evident for most people who prefer to pursue their higher education studies in the United States rather than in their homes' countries. However, America must improve its education system because of stiff competition from other countries across Europe and Asia. Studies show that the United States has the largest gap between low and best achievers in education. Study Corgi can help you make your studies smarter. Visit studycorgi.com for more samples like this, study tips, and writing tools.